It's been a wretched December for Bristol City. Boss Lee Johnson said he was massively disappointed with his side's dire defending in the Boxing Day defeat at Charlton. They're on a dismal run of four straight losses that have seen them slip out of the playoff places. Luton have big problems too. The injury time leveller they conceded at home to Fulham on Thursday means they now sit precariously in the drop zone. Pressure then on both bosses, Lee Johnson and Graham Jones. De Silva giving his goalkeeper Daniel Bentley an early touch and that's excellent distribution from the keeper. Here's Eliasson, who is a box of tricks. He's made room for the cross, Watkins arriving and scoring! His first appearance for six weeks and it's taken him just four minutes to get on the score sheet. Marley Watkins goal but what an assist! from Eliasson. Fullback wasn't close enough, the cross was perfect, and he found the far corner. Just wonder exactly what part of his body it hit though. Not that it matters, was it an arm? He won't care. Just the start that Lee Johnson wanted. And you've lost four on the spin. A little bit of doubt can creep in. And positive early on, Brown here. Always wants the ball, Nudge. Luton can't get near it at the moment. And that's another great ball, what a chance. And Jeju really should have done better. All on his own. The run wasn't tracked. Delicious cross again. Very presentable opportunity. It's all Bristol City here. Eliasson. He's a tricky customer. And he's got another cross in. And it's come a long way through in the shot. There wasn't really enough sting in it. From uh, Weiman. And he's got quick feet, hasn't he, Eliasson? Had to rush it, really, the Austrian, so he couldn't get the power. Bentley's long clearance. Oshaju causing problems again in the air. Ryman involved again. It's out for Jack Hunt, who sets it up, but that's a decent strike. Josh Brownhill forcing the save from James Shea. Back in the side today, Shea after a spin out injured. Might be a busy afternoon for him. Seen nothing so far from Luton Town going forward. We've seen plenty from Bristol City. And this man Eliasson in particular. Jeju went for the spectacular. That would have been some goal. Nothing like self-confidence though. Only one thought in his mind. This is a kick from outside the box. Just storming forward. This is the silver. Eliasson again. Just get the ball to him at every opportunity. He's round the back for a, a second time and a good ball too. And an excellent piece of goalkeeping from Shea. It was Watkins header. And Shea at full stretch to keep it out, but all about Eliasson's delivery again. Just couldn't cope with him, Luke Bolton. Headed it down, that's excellent goalkeeping, really is. Problems are mounting for Luton. A goal down here. They just haven't been in the match. Ten defeats in the last 14 for Luton Town. Staring at another one here. Now then, the referee's had a look at that and says penalty. It was Luar Luar's challenge. He was the wrong side of Jack Hunt. And literally a minute before half-time, Bristol City have a golden chance to double the lead. The protest won't come to anything. Well, just a question of if there was contact. Referee clearly thought there was, he was well placed on Langford.
Jeju, no problem. Well, I said he was uh, in a confident mood earlier. That was nonchalant, that spot kick. Sent the keeper the wrong way. And it's 2-0 Bristol City, and no more than they deserve. You'd imagine that uh, Graham Jones would have given his team something of a verbal volley in the dressing room. They can't be as bad in the second half. This is more promising. This is Cornick. Decent save, and then off the line by Jack Hunt. Well, he can't come any closer to scoring. And Hunt's heroics on the goal line save the day. He did really well to get back there after the keeper had got a hand on it. Best spell that Lund have had, although, in truth, that's not saying an awful lot. Is there any way through for Luana? Not that time. Well, that was a decent strike from Mpanzu. Was travelling. Didn't just come back enough. He set it outside that far post and it quite curl sufficiently. Vyman. Goalkeeper should get this, but the referee's going to pull it back and give a free kick. Once he saw there was no advantage accruing. Yellow card as well for Bradley. Oh, now then, straight at the goalkeeper from Jeju. Anywhere else, either side, it would surely be 3 0. So much pushing and shoving in there. Straight down Shea's throat. Hunt. He's had a good game, the fullback. Looking for Jeju. Didn't reach him that time. Eliasson wreaking havoc again. Eliasson. Crowd want handball. They're not going to get it. But the threat is omnipresent down the right hand side. Hunt. Vyman. Now it's three. Brilliant from Jack Hunt. And Vyman in exactly the right place. Near post, just had to turn it in. Well, after four straight defeats, it's been a wonderful performance thus far for Bristol City. Well, to give Luton credit, they're still trying to come forward, even though nothing's worked for them in front of goal today. This is Cornick. Forced to go back, Moncur. Cornick again, got the shot in, slight deflection on it. At least it was an effort on goal from Harry Cornick. Eliasson, the old soft shoe shuffle, who really has had the beating of uh, well, pretty much every defender they put in front of him. They stopped him that time, but the ricochet still fell to Bristol City, and the little chip just clearing. James Shea's crossbar, although he would have had it covered anyway, I suspect. Well, that was a clever effort from Vyman. He's that kind of player. Suspect it would only be a consolation if uh, Luton were to find a way through now, but it might be four, because here comes Vyman. In the last few minutes, oh, miscontrol, that was a pity. Luton just about clear their lines, but it's been a dismal day for them. Bristol City snapped that run. Pressure off Lee Johnson for a few days at least. Pressure on Graham Jones. They stay in the drop zone. A comprehensive victory then as Bristol City revive their playoff hopes. Final score at Ashton Gate. Bristol City 3, Luton Town 0.